a presentation of TFNN. O'Brien Show is produced every business day. Tom takes your phone calls toll free at 1 877 927 6648. Internationally at 727 445 1044. Let's go to our man Dave in Clearwater. Hey, Dave, Happy New Year. What's happening, man? <clears throat> happy New Year to you, my brother. How are you, sir? I'm doing great, man. How you been? I am doing well, man. I'm doing well. Can I throw a quote out at you? Sure. <laughs> in the market, somebody knows something. Someone always knows something. That statement was made by a great trader by the name of Tom O'Brien about six, seven years ago. Oh, yeah. And it kind of hit me like a brick. You're right. Somebody always knows something. Hey, Carlos, what's going on, brother? I'm calling you back, Tom. This morning I had a pleasure to talk to you and your son, and I don't want to miss the opportunity to talk to you again. Why? Well, I think you made some money on this bond. <laughs> oh, yes, Tom. Your newsletter helped me. That's a beautiful to, uh, thing. We appreciate the growling problem us out here. Now, Tom O'Brien. <laughs> Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go 10 hours a day. We go 24 hours a day on the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. It's a TGIF. Let's make it a great one, folks. Yesterday's gone. Tomorrow's not here. What are you doing right now? Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 64, 21,847. NASDAQ up three, 6274. SP's up five and a half, 2446. Gold contract up six dollars, trading at 12.97 an ounce. Uh, you talk about a ride on gold. You just heard Tommy doing that update. Bottom line, they threw two million ounces at gold this morning and couldn't break it. Bottom line went down. We've had a price spread of $20 in gold today. Bottom line, you got buyers that are just sitting there buying, buying, buying. Silver, up $0.09, cents, $17.14. Platinum, down 2 bucks, nine seventy-seven an ounce. Copper, three oh five a pound. Copper is on a tear, folks. Copper looks like it wants to run to the three twenty-three mark. We're at two fifty dollars all of about two months ago. Oil, light sweet crude, up $0.44, cents, trading $47.87 a barrel. Notes. 10-year note, up five ticks, 127.27, 126.27, 30-year bond up 13 ticks, 156.16. Both notes and bonds, folks, they're going after their June swing highs. They will not back off. And king dollar, get the butter out, get the toast out, butter it up. It's done. Down 762 ticks, 92.450. Good old king dollar here, folks. Okay, listen. King Dollar was trying to get a dead cat bounce, couldn't get the dead cat bounce going. Now what you have is this. This is pretty intense. King Dollar right now is down 750, 47 ticks. You've done 38,000 contracts. You're coming into a B point of a monster ABC structure on the way down. This structure, folks, uh, is pretty intense. If we take a look at this, what you're going to see is this. So the... I was looking for King Dollar to get down to approximately the 88 mark, on, but that was with King Dollar bouncing to at least the 95 mark. Well, good old King Dollar could only make it to 94.000. What we have here is, is this now. Your A point on this is 97.70. Your B point on this is 92.39. Uh, we're dealing, well, actually, one second. Hold on. There is, no, you you. Yeah, you know, your A point is 101. Your 101 is your A point. 92 is your B. You get approximately 9 bucks. 94 is your C. And we are, we are talking um, about going into approximately about the 85 mark and good old King Dollar. So that is one big number, folks. No, no two ways about that when you're taking a look at it. Euro. The euro uh, is breaking topside. The euro is at 119.27. The yen is out here at 108.22. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world. In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. Because this is what you have with the S&Ps now. This is going to be pretty wild as we come into this close. And what I expect you're going to see when we come into this close is you're going to see a little bit more selling. What we've done out here is this. The SPY has hit a price point today of 245.61. We've done 37 million shares. The high of 
Tuesday, which was testing, is 245.62. So you missed it by a penny. You have volume of 63 million on the on Tuesday, the 22nd. That was going into the downdraft from the 17th. So the downdraft of the 17th had 128 million. So as we go over this, I'm going to go over the last couple of weeks to see, to show you where this market is and where I expect it's going to be. So if we go back right to the last high, the last high, folks, was on the 8th of August. We reached $248. We made that high with 61.7 million shares. We come off that high with 120 million. Down, fast, wide price spread, all the above. Then we do a counter trend bounce. As we do that counter trend bounce, the, we go up on 74 million, 73 million, and then we give it up at the high of 56 million. So you remember, you go down on 120, you're trying to make a high of 56. The market lets loose again, comes down with 128 million. We go from a price point of 246 to 243. We do another counter trend bounce. This this counter trend bounce was on Tuesday. That counter trend bounce had 63 million shares versus the last counter trend bounce of 73 million. Now what you're doing is that now you've tested the high of Tuesday, dramatically lighter volume. Bottom line, we'll see whether we end up closing. Um, I suspect we are going to close under this 245.62, uh, but that's the way this market is set up right now. We look at it intraday, and what we have intraday right now is that the uh, SPY, just uh, just when I get on, we just went from 244.82 to 245.20. You can expect, uh, as we're coming into this close out here, I, I'm going to expect a lot more volatility. You get draggy. Uh, that is speaking right now. And if we actually go over and we take a look at that euro, what you're going to have inside the euro is this. Euro right now. Uh, has broken topside, and this is this is a big break topside, folks. I mean, a monster break. Uh, when you take a look at this, what you're going to see is that we have just gone from 117 euros to one dollar to 119.31. The 119.31 is taken out the swing point from the 2nd of August, and this more than likely is a large ABC up. Your A point on this is 111. Your B point up here is 119, so you're talking about eight pennies. Your C point is 116. We're talking about a 124 coming at us. Uh, so if we do go over and we take a look at this uh, gold contract, because what you're going to see, the, the correlation is direct, folks. I mean, direct as you can get. So when you take a look at this correlation, what you're going to see right now, gold is only down, uh, only up 380. Uh, the difference, the, the price in gold today went from 1301 to 1281. When it, when it got down to 1281, so check this out. It gets down to 1281. Someone sold $2 million in contracts in the gold market, and guess what? It didn't matter. There was someone sitting there buying it right on the other end. And if you happen to be watching Tiger TV, what you're going to see is you're going to see how dramatic that downdraft was. And the only way that could snap back that quick, which it did, is those artists were laying there saying, bye, bye, bye. This is Tom O'Brien. This is TFNN. You stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Let's call, folks. If you're an active trader looking for that extra edge when it comes to trading and investments, then now is a great time to get a two-week free trial to Tom O'Brien's daily market letter, Market Insights. Tom O'Brien's daily newsletter, Market Insights, comes out every market day at around 9.30 a.m. and provides Tom's daily commentary on the broad market, including the Dow, NASDAQ, and S&P, plus specific trade recommendations. There's even an update published most afternoons to keep you informed about the day's market activity. He'll give you the entry price, price target, and stock price of each stock and option trade. With Market Insights, there's nothing left to guessing. For all the details and to get your two-week free trial to Market Insights started today, visit TFNN.com. 
In quiet markets, investors search for new trading opportunities. We'd like to introduce you to a new product that provides opportunities even in flat markets. Nadex, the North American Derivatives Exchange, is a new and innovative Chicago-based exchange registered with the Commodity Futures Trading Commission. And unlike most other exchanges, Nadex allows you to trade directly through them with direct market access when using their trading platform. Nadex never charges a fee to use their platform, which even includes real-time charts and full custom capability. Nadex's unique short-term binary options allow traders and investors to capitalize on strategies even when the underlying markets are quiet. Nadex's innovation has allowed them to come up with a line of unique trading products that are unavailable anywhere else. See how it works at Nadex.com. That's N-A-D-E-X.com or click on the Nadex banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Futures and options trading involves risk and may not be appropriate for all investors. Until recently, it was almost impossible for the average investor to hedge against currency risk in Europe or Japan. For a bold trade on Europe or Japan that protects against moves in currency, trade HEGE or HEGJ, two times currency hedged leveraged ETFs from Direction Investments. Visit directioninvestments.com today. An investor should consider the investment objectives, risks, charges, and expenses of the Direction shares carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about Direction shares. To obtain a prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact Direction shares at 866-476-7523. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. An investment in the funds is subject to risk, including the possible loss of principal. The funds are designed to be utilized only by sophisticated investors, such as traders and active investors. Distributor Foresight Fund Services, LLC. Tom, take your phone calls now. now. Toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-445-1044. Welcome back, folks. 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in y'all world. Now, the world of TFNN, folks, for all you folks in the New England area, in fact, for everyone right across the country, we are coming up to Boston September 30th. We're going to be doing a great workshop, the Out of the Time and Trade Workshop. This is a workshop. It is going to be free for all you tigers and tigresses. Uh, Nadex uh, is sponsoring the workshop. Uh, you can come over to our website at TFNN. You're going to see it right on the front page. We launched this uh, Wednesday afternoon. Uh, it's going to be at the Burlington Marriott, Marriott, which is right outside Boston. You get a great radius, uh, you know, where, wherever you uh, may be up there. Uh, so it is, it's Saturday, September 30th, uh, 745 to 1 in the afternoon. 745 to 830, we're going to be serving a continental breakfast, 830 to 845. Uh, our man, Mr. Dan Kip from Nadex, he's going to be, do a welcome remarks. Uh, Tommy, uh, my son Tommy, is going to be introducing the, the workshop. Uh, I'm going to be on from 9 to 10.30. Uh, we'll have a coffee break. Daryl Martin is going to be teaching from uh, 10.45 to 12.15, and both Daryl and I will be up there from 12.15 to 1 o'clock. Uh, you can sign up for the workshop. What you do get with the workshop, folks, is a free copy, uh, signed copy of my book, The Art of Timing the Trade. Uh, how price and volume move markets. You can check it out over the weekend at TFNN. Um, and bottom line, you know, if you're going to go, great, sign up. But if you're not sure, don't sign up just yet, all okay, right, folks? Because uh, bottom line is that uh, we have so much space. We can get more space. We're not saying you don't have to go rush. But we would like to uh, understand how many people will be coming. As you're also over to TFNN, um, we start talking the uh, markets, uh, bottom line, gold. So last Monday was the 800th edition of the Gold Report. Uh, we've done a special all week. The special is over Sunday night. So if you want to be in the gold market, look at the metal market, get a very um, good value for your money. Uh, we've done the special. Last time I did the special was 200 weeks ago. I did it for the 600th report. We're doing it for the 800th report. And what it is is this. You can get 60 issues of the Gold Report for $600. Normally, the gold report is $85 a month. So you can check that out on the front page of TFNN. Now, let's go take a look at these markets. Uh, these markets is going to be wild uh, watching how we come into the close out here. Uh, it, we are not going to get volume in this market. So if we look at this market right now, um, and what we have got thus far is that you've got the test of these Friday highs. 
of these Tuesday highs, rather. Uh, we've done 399 million thus far in the NYSE. Uh, that little baby is going into 688 million. If we go take a look at the NDX 100, you just use the three Qs. What you're going to see inside the three Qs, uh, three Qs out here are trading at a price point of 142.29. The high uh, of Tuesday was 143.35. The Qs made 143.18. Uh, we had volume of 36 million shares there. Guess what? You're 20 million shares. These things are anemic. I mean anemic in a big way. If we go take a look at the IWM, now the IWM has been the weakest uh, indice out here. Uh, so this is going to get intriguing to see uh, exactly how this IWM, uh, if in fact it can hold this price. The IWM is higher today. It's at 71 cents. You're at 137.18. That being said, you know, you're coming into 32 million shares, you've done 12 million. So that thing is anemic in a huge way. Now, you got good old um, Hurricane coming in fast, furious. Uh, this is going to be a problem, child, uh, inside, no doubt, you know, all the folks down in Texas. Uh, hopefully, uh, everyone's going to be all right down there. Bottom line is that it's going into the refinery area. Um, the gas prices themselves, they popped in a big way. They've given it up thus far. Um, right now, gasoline, unleaded gasoline is down three-tenths of one percent. That being said, it's had a heck of a run. We hit 159 out here today. Um, and that is one monster run. And uh, right now, it back down. The last high, swing high I was going after is 160, which was left over from the 12th of April. Uh, you get 158,000 contracts uh, in this number. That's 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 a big number. So that's also saying that the unleaded gas is going to be back topside once again. So you can expect uh, there's going to be some high volatility. What we also have, and this is where it's going to be really intriguing here, is that oil cannot catch a bid. Uh, so we have plenty of oil. And I mean, when I say plenty of oil... Uh, for the aspect that, you know, you're coming into it, you get a storm coming in, huge storm coming in, not just a storm, um, and oil can't move. Uh, oil out here today, the September contract trading at uh, 47.64, that doesn't look like it wants to go anywhere. And I mean anywhere. There's just, that's just the way that that baby is shaking out. Um, big, big numbers, man. Big numbers all across the board. Let's go back over to that dollar because the dollar is going to be the story, folks. This dollar, this dollar is building cars. It's uh, even as we're coming into the close here. You're, you're talking about uh, right now 100, uh, 40, 40,900 contracts. Uh, we are at 92.470, and we've hit 92.345. Now 93, 92.345. Breaks the low. The low that, we, that was going after is 92.390. So what I expect you're going to see here is that as we come into this close, this thing is going to get jammed. We could be down about a penny, which is a thousand ticks. We're at 729 right now. This is this is pretty pretty. The reason it's so big is this: since January 3rd, the dollar has gone one way, and that's down. We started at 103 January 3rd. We've hit. Today's the low, 92.345. It's not only the low, though. You're breaking the low at monster volume. So that's setting up this large ABC structure on the way down. It's like, okay. Now, if we get that ABC structure on the way down, I'm going to put the gold continuous contract up. You, you are going to see a rocket ship take off here because they've done everything to hold gold down, including today, and this is pretty impressive, throwing two million in gold at the market and the market not only took it the market took it put it in its pocket and then bought more that's, that's it's just pretty amazing so what are we going after we're going after folks the swing points from the april high the april high out here was 1294 the june high 1295.20 the high of last week is 1300 this is a confirmed abc structure on the way up and what I expect you're actually going to see is this. This baby doesn't look to me like it's going to stop at the ABC structure on the way up, the, three, the 1327. Your higher swing point is July of last year. 
That July of last year, swing high is 1376.50. That's where I expect it's going to go. Because you can see the type of cause that we've been building is extraordinary. Now, the, the cause hasn't been to you know really get through the April and June highs. The cause is because we came down so hard and fast in October. In October of 2016, we went from $1,316 to 1249 You can see we've almost eaten through that whole deal. In November... We went from 1338 to 1218. Vicious. Okay? That's what gold's been trying to do. Looks like it's going to make it through it. And next stop is 1377.50. You stay right there, folks. We'll be coming right back. Our phone number is 877 927 6648. Dow Industrials are up 73. NASDAQ's up four. SPs are up six and a half. We're going to be right back, folks. <laughs> Hey folks, the 800th edition of The Gold Report will be published next Monday. To celebrate the last 15 and a half years of calling the gold market, I'm doing a special promotion. You can receive 60 weeks of The Gold Report for only $600. That is $10 a week, which is a savings of 50% off the regular price. If you want to understand the entire supply and demand equations that move the gold market, including where the XAU, HUI, and mining equities are looking to trade, if you want to understand the correlation between the dollar, the yen, the South African rand, bonds, and gold, the gold report is for you. I'll give you the entry price, price target, and stop for each equity, ETF, future, or option trade. The gold report is a long-term newsletter with a focus on building real wealth to a successful portfolio of gold and silver equities. You can take advantage of this special promotion until August 27th. That's 60 weeks of the gold report for $600, which is a 50% savings. Go to the front page of TFNN.com or call 877-518-9190 and order now. If you're looking to open your portfolio to a world of opportunity, consider the new market-safe emerging currency CD from EverBank. This three-year U.S. dollar-denominated CD gives you exposure to five equally weighted currencies from Brazil, China, India, Indonesia, and Turkey at a time when experts see great potential for global growth. Even better, it features a 7.0 leverage factor, which means you could earn a potential market upside payment of seven times the CD's performance at maturity with no cap if the currencies increase in value over the CD's term. And should the opposite occur, your principal is 100% protected. Keep in mind, returns are based on CD performance. There is no annual percentage yield or periodic rate of interest on this index CD. Don't miss out. The September 28th funding deadline will be here before you know it. So call 1-855-750-4051 or visit everbank.com slash TFNN for the CD's term sheet and other important product details and disclosures. This advertisement is sponsored content. Everbank is a division of TIAA, FSB, member FDIC. Hi, I'm Steve Rhodes, host of The Trader's Edge, heard daily at TFNN.com and author of Mastering Probability, a daily investment and trading newsletter service that I send out each morning by 8 a.m. My morning newsletter service covers exactly what the markets have been doing since last night's close, providing you with an edge on your trading day ahead. You get actionable trading ideas, including the exact entry, stop, and profit targets. Plus, I'll teach you the patterns and hidden market correlations that will make you a better trader. As a subscriber, you'll gain access to my 90-minute money management workshop, where I'll teach you the secrets that'll save your assets. The bottom line, I've got your back, including a 30-day money-back guarantee. See for yourself the type of analysis I provide each trading day by signing up for Mastering Probability today. With nothing to lose, this is an offer you should not pass on. Mastering Probability can be found under trading newsletters on the front page of TFNN.com. This segment is brought to you by Think or Swim. For more information, just click the Think or Swim banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow Industrials right now are up 74. You get the NASDAQ up five. S&Ps are up uh, six and a half. And if we uh, get over and we take a look at, so uh, you've had um, the Jackson Hole uh, meeting uh, out here, bottom line, started last night, goes all weekend. Uh, everyone's uh, looking, uh, bottom line, what is Draghi going to be saying? What is Yellen going to be saying? Uh, so uh, some of the uh, top highlights out here, Draghi does offer a rather curious example of uh, European uh, countries working together to adapt to common regulation enforcement that help their market flourish. Here's his uh, quote. The internal market for frozen... Uh, oh, <laughs> 
that's really uh and anyway it, i don't have to read that quote bottom line is that what has happened as he's been speaking right now is that this euro has gone topside uh, in a large way folks um that is going to uh continue uh to put some big juice into not just the gold contract by the way that is going to put uh, juice into all these commodities if we go over to the silver market and we take a look at the silver market for a second what you're going to see is this silver's trading uh, out here today at seventeen dollars and fourteen cents that being said what you've had out here is that you're talking about a price spread in silver out here today We've had a low of sixteen dollars and eighty cents. You have a high of seventeen twenty-six. So you're talking about a forty-six cent price spread. That's a monster price spread. You've had forty-two thousand contracts traded. Uh, this little baby is pushing. Also, it looks like into a B of well, of an additional ABC structure in the way up. And silver looks like, um, you know, you get a run number one number one to seventeen eighty-eight. That's the high of June, but you very well can get up into this 1888 uh, area, and that would be quite a run. Some of the higher volume stocks out here today, if we take a look at them, this is what you're looking at. You have uh, Chesapeake Energy's down four cents. You get Bank of America off five. Uh, GameStop's off two and a half. You have, uh, let's see, Ultra Salon is the ULTA. This, is, this thing has got killed out here today. And uh, this is a company... Uh, that made their numbers, but bottom line, um, the market is saying um, next quarter, well, the company's saying next quarter they might have some problems. So, Ultra has just gone in three months from $314 to 214 Now, this is their problem. This is a huge ABC structure on the way down, okay? Your A point is 314 Your B point is 228 You know, you're talking about uh, $84. Your C point is out here is at 247, so you know you're basically talking about a buck 70 uh, coming at you. Now, if we take a look at Ultra and we see Ultra, you're going to see at 192, you know, you get some support. Um, 170, <laughs> which is the ABC structure, is where all the volume is if you break this 192. This is pretty intense, you know. Um, these stocks love to fly, but, man, when they take the elevator down, that is about as heavy as you can get. And this is a classic. This is a classic, you know, you get a high with no volume. You come off the high with volume. Um, it escalates as you keep going to lower price. Let's go over to the XLE because what you're going to see inside the XLE, now this is quite impressive in the aspect that you get a huge stomp coming in, uh, and the XLE still can't get moving. Yeah, You're up 39 cents. You're going against 14.7 million, and guess what? Bottom line, you are uh, doing 6.3 million. So huge, huge number, huge, huge number. If we do give you a, a little update uh, on the storm here, so let's see what they're having to say. How this is this is pretty intense. This is really intense, actually, because if you've ever been in a hurricane, folks, and my son and I, and my daughter, actually, we've been in. We were in Bob, all three of us, and then Tommy and I were in Katrina. So we've been in some beauties, man. Um, and they're dangerous, they're fast, they're furious, and all of the above. So take them seriously. Now, this storm here, let's see, uh, Hurricane Harvey will be the most powerful storm since 2008 to strike the heart of Americans' uh, energy sector with winds reaching, oh, my God, 120 miles an hour as it bears down on South Texas coastline. Uh, Harvey strength to Category 3, the National Hurricane said in an advisory posted at 2 p.m. local time. Uh, that's 3 p.m. our time, by the way, okay, because that's it. they're talking Texas time. The storm uh, is coming up uh, Texas Gulf Coast, home to as much as one-half the nation's oil refinery. Harvey, the strongest uh, storm to hit the United States since Wilmer in 2005, is forecast uh, to... Get into Houston, Corpus Christi, Galveston. That's, that's a problem. Uh, those cities have 2.6 million people that can get hit. Uh, right now, they're thinking the storm can generate uh, 1.9 billion in damage. Uh, so it's it's a big one. Uh, Javi has drifted from the southern Gulf of Mexico, raining strength after passing uh, Mexico's Utah Peninsula early this week. While the course has spared much of the oil and gas production in the Gulf, it's set to hit a cluster of refineries that process 5 million barrels a day. 
Um, Javi could deliver a one-two punch that could also spell trouble for the Houston Ship Channel. Um, a one forecast model shows that the storm returning to the Gulf of Mexico before making a second landfall closer to the Galveston. Let's hope that doesn't happen. Uh, because uh, what, what does, uh, you know, these storms are vicious. Javi uh, is looking to dump 35 inches of rain uh, on the area over in the next week. 35, uh, the Federal Emergency Management Agency is sending staff and supplies to the region. Uh, bottom line is that uh, you get a problem child that's laying out here. This is one big monster storm. There's no doubt about it. And yes, that, folks, that is three feet of rain. I can't even comprehend it. I mean, they, I don't mean to be laughing. That's that's sad. That's that's not right. But three feet of rain. Yes, three feet of rain. So um, let's go uh, all state here. I want to show you something here. We were, we were doing this yesterday. We were looking at these insurance companies. And what you're going to see is that there's this year. The insurance companies, folks, don't go down in hurricanes. We were bringing this up yesterday because what happens, you know, they get one, two days, one is on the way down. And then what ends up happening is that they get hit, meaning, you know, and no one's paid for hurricanes for a long period of time. But guess what? As soon as they get hit, they can go back to the regulators. They say to the regulators, hey, we just got hit. We need to raise our rates again. You know, so uh, they they like, I suspect they like to get hit slightly, uh, just enough so that they go back to the regulatory bodies and turn around and say, hey, listen, we did get hit. Here it is. We're pulling out of your state if you don't let us go up on uh, these insurance premiums once again. And, of course, what, what will happen out here is that the debate is going to uh, go up once again about the flood insurance on these bodies of waters, uh, meaning, you know, and believe me, in, in Pinellas County, folks, uh, I know all about it because what does happen, Pinellas County, surrounded three, three times by water, bottom line, um, you know, it's only uh, some places are only two feet, over sea level, other, you know, the highest I think we get is about uh, 30 feet. But so the, there's there's a there's a problem with that. There's no doubt that you have flood insurance, you get wiped out. Bottom line, you know that it's going to be taken care of if you do it again. So uh, thank God none of these uh, places have actually really got hit right along the coast, meaning uh, you know a, a direct hit. A direct hit would be a whole different ball game out here. You stay right there, folks. We'll be coming right back. Right now, the s and uh, you can expect this volatility to continue into the close. Now, don't forget, folks, if you'd like to come to the workshop, that's September 30th. Boston, check it out on the front page of TFNN. You want to be in the gold market? You want a great deal? You have until Sunday night. 60 issues of the Gold Report for only $600. That's one half price as a celebration of my 800th Gold Report. Many of our new listeners have heard about the Tiger's Den, but wondered, what exactly is it? The Tiger's Den is a lively community where professional traders and investors can meet, exchange ideas and information, in a comfortable, moderated atmosphere. Hear all of your favorite TFNN shows, plus see all the charts as they happen live during those shows and have access to all those charts. You can test drive the Tiger's Den absolutely free for 30 days. It will greatly enrich your knowledge of these markets. Details on the Tiger's Den are on the front page of TFNN.com. Tiger TV is an exciting way to experience TFNN programming. See high definition video giving you crystal clear charts as well as seeing some of the faces of TFNN's highly acclaimed financial experts with crisp full fidelity sound. Catch Tom O'Brien, John Logan, Steve Rhodes, Basil Chapman, Larry Pesavento, Think or Swim, David White, Andy Hecht, and Daryl Martin in crystal clear, high-definition audio and video. Tiger TV, exclusively at TFNN.com. Tiger Real Estate Opportunity Fund is currently offering four-year first mortgages on many of the fully renovated properties that it has purchased. The first mortgages are third-party appraised with a maximum loan-to-value ratio of 70%, providing a secured investment that pays a fixed return of 5% annually, which works out to a monthly income of more than $416 per $100,000 investment with your principal intact and secured. These four-year first mortgages are perfect for anyone looking for a secured investment that provides monthly income much like a CD. 
For more information, email tigerfund at tfnn.com or click on the Tiger Real Estate Opportunity Fund banner along the right side of the tfnn.com homepage or call our office directly at 877-518-9190. There's a limited supply, so act now. The Path of Least Resistance is David White's daily trading newsletter, and if you're looking for active trading ideas, then now's a perfect time for a 30-day free trial to this powerful daily trading advisory service. David uses his years of trading experience to offer his subscribers his trading ideas each morning in his Path of Least Resistance newsletter. Using a combination of equity trades along with options, David keeps his subscribers up to date with all pertinent market information with intraday afternoon updates when warranted. Don't miss out on this great chance to get a 30-day free trial to David's daily newsletter, The Path of Least Resistance, with no obligation to pay anything. David has been delivering solid recommendations for his subscribers recently, and if you'd like to see the type of newsletter he delivers every morning, then visit the front page of TFNN, and you'll find The Path of Least Resistance under Trading Newsletters. For all the details, and to start your 30-day free trial today, log on to TFNN. Dot com now. Tom, take your phone calls now. now. Toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-445-1044. Tom O'Brien. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow Industrials right now are up 63. You get the NASDAQ up two. S&Ps are up five. And if we go take a look at this gold trade, you got to see this. This is pretty amazing. So, uh, okay, where is she? Let me see this thing. Let's see. There we go. Okay, so okay, so much for a quiet Friday in late August. After weeks of relative slumber, gold traders were rudely awoken to a surge in volume and volatility. And the span, and we were right in front of the screen when this happened, folks. It was pretty cool, actually. Uh, in a span of one minute, gold futures contracts equaling more than 2 million ounces traded about 20 minutes before the federal chair Janet Yellen was to address the gathering of policymakers in Jackson Hole. The episode jolted the market after a measure of 60-day volatility on the metal touched its lowest since 2005. Check that out. Gold had been qu in quiet mood even among political discord in Washington, concerns about raising interest rates, tensions of U.S. and Korea. Yellen's speech would lack clear rate clues, did little to calm the price swings and dampened expectations of a rate hike this year. Now, the cool thing is, is this, is that when you, so the, the speculation, folks, flat out, is that that was a sell, okay? And it's always a speculation how this goes. The reason it's a speculation is that um, unless you took the audit, you really don't know whether it's a buyer or a sell. Now, I'd say it's a sell. The reason being is that we went from a price point of $13.01, I mean $13.01, uh, $1301, uh, at 910 and then we went straight down to 1281. Now, this is the cool thing. 20 bucks, yeah, that's, that's a big number. You know, you're talking about something that's trading at 1300 bucks, right? That's, that's one way of looking at it. The other way of looking at it, guess what? The market ate that $2 million in a heartbeat, put it in its pocket, and then bought more. That's, that's the number. That's the number that is impressive. You know, if you're a bull, if you're a bear, I, you know, God bless you, because <laughs> guess what? This thing has been consolidating uh, since April, and each one of these highs are getting more powerful. You know, I talk about the, the testing on the S&P right now. Each one of the counter trend bounces have got lighter. Well, it's just the opposite in gold. In gold, each one of these pushes into the highs have gotten more intense. When we pushed into the high last week, just so you can see this, we pushed into the high last week with 397,000 contracts. That's huge. We, you know what we did today? What we're doing today? 346,000 contracts. Bottom line, you have some monster buyers inside this market. You know, if we, let's go take a look at the uh, GDX. We'll see how that's laying out because they're all laying right at the top of these highs. Uh, the GDX, so this is going to be impressive. So the GDX right now is up 11 cents. You've done 21 million shares. Now what's impressive is this. What happens with the GDX is that the amount of volume goes in, it comes in right at the, the 
close. So what I expect we're going to see, the GDX is going to probably end up doing around 40 million shares. That would be a nice setup. Uh, why would it be a nice setup? Because when we take a look at this and we put this on a weekly, you're still pushing into the swing point, and so we'll get that 200 million. We're still going to need more than 200 million. We need on a weekly basis, we need about 300 million, but we get we'll get 200 million. If we take a look at the uh, XAU, the HUI, these little babies also performing well, uh, particularly the uh, XAU. The XAU right now uh, has. We're at one, we're at 85, 87. No, it's the HUI that we're, actually is more impressive here. Let's go through the XAU first. XAU's at 85, 87. That's still pressing into the 86, 74 level from July. Now watch the HUI. This is the gold bugs index. And the difference when this happens too, by the way, folks, is this, is that the gold bugs index, you can't hedge more than get the exact number, whether it's a year and a half or two years. You can't, uh, let's see. Yeah, you can't hedge your production more than one and a half years out. So the way that that works is that if you are in the gold bugs index, that is saying that the price of gold is going to be going up quicker if, in fact, you see that the gold bugs index, which is the HUI, is stronger than the XAU. And that's exactly what we have right now. Uh, the gold bugs index has taken uh, your swing point out going back to the August level. It's going after the June level right now, June 6th. It looks to me like the good old gold bugs index is going to be running up to this uh, 216, and right now you're at 20110. Um, as we come into this close, I'm going to keep going back to this dollar because uh, this dollar is serious business. And what you do have with the dollar. And we've seen that the ama you know what the amazing part is? What is wild is that between currencies and the gold market, well, th let's just talk dollar and gold at this point. Fridays are vicious. And I expect, you know, I, I, I'd say what probably happened this morning was that whatever operator that was that, you know, got that market down 20 bucks in the gold, sold those 2 million ounces, wanted to break the market. And guess what? They didn't. So the real question is, if they couldn't break that market, did they decide, okay, can't break that market? You know what? Let's go break the dollar down because they're selling this dollar, man. You're talking about 43,000 contracts right now. The B point is 20,000 contracts. So this is taking it apart, taking it apart with volume. Um, the next stop will be 88 on this. Uh, there's nothing in the middle between here and 88. Now, the shocker is going to be, of course, uh, if, in fact, we just blow away that 88 and the way that it's set up right now, that would actually be very easy to do. You know, the and it, what 88 is, folks, 88 is the high of 2008 as well as the high of 2010. You know, in the crash, we came down to $70, 70 U.S. dollars um, in the index. Bottom line, this is... Uh, you know, once we get into 89, the next stop is a 72. So something is hanging out here that, in fact, is making our dollar a lot weaker. Um, and we'll find out. It's when, when you get an expansion or a contraction, in this case, um, that's this heavy, most of the time, you know, the market knows first. Um, certainly inside the oil market, you can see that the XLE picked up that uh, the oil contract was going to not go higher and, in fact, stay lower. We'll find out uh, going forward, you know, just why the, our dollar is going down so dramatically. You know, I mean, we had a call this afternoon, uh, this morning, uh, Steve from Bar Barrow, uh, Alaska. And, you know, he's saying, hey, you know, the, the euro is going up. There's not much to the euro. And I, you know what? I, when you look at the euro, it's hard to comprehend that, you know, why is that happening? Well, it is. And, you know, the euro right now, if we, if we do the other correlation to this, this euro is not only strong, um, it's been consistent and it has been consistent since January. You know, that's, uh, this thing hit a low out here of uh, 103. It was one oh a dollar three euro to the U.S. dollar. Now, it's a dollar nineteen, 
And guess what? At a dollar nineteen, that ain't nothing. This thing is going up to like a dollar thirty-nine, a dollar forty. That's intense. You know? You stay right there, folks. We'll be coming right back. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Dow Industrials right now are up 50. NASDAQ's down one. S&Ps are up four. We're going to be right back. Larry Pesavento has just started his brand new service, Fibonacci 24-7, and he's already delivering content to his subscribers on a daily basis when the market's opened and even on weekends. Each Monday, you'll receive Larry's written report that provides detailed commentary and a summary on the charts and videos that Larry sends out. And throughout the week, when warranted, Larry will send out via charts or videos or both the key markets that he is watching during the day. This will be up-to-the-date active trading information that will help you in your daily trading. In Larry's first week alone, he sent out 25 charts, six videos, and a full report to his subscribers in just one week. If you're a technical trader that uses patterns and retracements to trade, then Larry's service Fibonacci 24-7 is something that you must try. Right now, new subscribers can get a full 30-day money-back guarantee. With nothing to risk, sign up now to Larry Pesavento's Fibonacci 24-7 by visiting the front page of TFNN.com under Trading Newsletters. Since 1984, Basil Chapman has been using the Chapman Wave methodology to advise traders of his expert market opinion. While originally hand-drawing charts from the late 1970s into the 1980s, Basil noticed that prices under most circumstances virtually always had a certain number of legs to the upside before declining sharply. Later, Basil found that computer software, which included the standard market technical indicators, enhanced the degree of accuracy in calling price turns, as well as market trend calls. Thus was born the Chapman Wave sequence. Using the Chapman Wave methodology along with other indicators, Basil Chapman advises his subscribers of his expert market opinion each market day with his opening call newsletter. Right now, you can get a two-week free trial to the opening call, Basil's daily trading newsletter, by visiting the front page of TFNN.com. Cancel at any time during that trial and pay absolutely nothing. Get your two-week free trial to Basil's newsletter, The Opening Call, today by visiting TFNN.com. TFNN is excited about our new software charting program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts. In collaboration with Tom O'Brien and using his best-selling book, The Art of Timing the Trade, Your Ultimate Trading Mastery System, David White has programmed an outstanding piece of software that will complement any trader's methodology. Using this first-of-its-kind program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts allows you to scan thousands of stocks for Fibonacci formation setups, including Gartley's, ABC's, Butterflies, and much more. The Art of Timing the Trade Charts is designed to help you when scouring the markets for stocks just beginning to form the trading patterns that many investors spend days, weeks, or even months searching to find. And right now, we're offering licenses available at only $79 a month. We are so confident that you're going to love this new charting software that will even give you a 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. Don't miss out on this incredible new piece of software. Get your copy of The Art of Timing the Trade Charts today by visiting TFNN.com. Don't forget, you can listen to TFNN live on your mobile device 24 hours per day. Go to TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. That's TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV for the latest market information. <laughs> Welcome back, folks. And folks, don't forget, we just launched the uh, live workshop, uh, Boston, September 30th. It's going to be at the Burlington Marriott. This is a workshop. It's sponsored by Nadex. It's a free workshop. You want to understand the market, uh, bisecting and dissecting it with us live. Come on, uh, uh, you know, basically sign up. Uh, it's a quarter of eight in the morning to one in the afternoon. You're going to get a continental breakfast, a break, a lot of great education. And, of course, uh, Nadex is picking up the tab. So, um we appreciate their sponsorship. Uh, come on and see us. The Gold Report. This is your last weekend to get the Gold Report, folks. Uh, it's the celebration of the 800th uh, edition. Uh, you can get 60 editions at $600. That is half price. Uh, that will be down on Sunday night. So uh, if you want to get it, now is the time to get it. We can open. We take a look at the S&Ps. We have uh, coming into the close out here. We're going to have a failure on price, failure on volume right across the indices. The uh, the future uh, traded to 24.53, 50 today. Uh, bottom line is that if you take a look at this, what you're going to see, uh, try to get up into the highs of uh, Tuesday. Couldn't handle it. 24.54.25 
If we take a look at the SPY, same type of setup. You get a failure on price, failure on volume. What's going to get intriguing here is that, of course, next week, you know, you're going to be coming into window dressing. It's like, okay, we're going to get window breaking instead of window dressing. Uh, the SPY today got to a price point of $245.61. The test was two forty-five sixty-two, one penny. The volume characteristic was $63 million. We're at 47 So you're going to have a failure in price and volume. What does that set up? That sets up lower prices coming at us next week. And what I expect is going to be the culprit, folks, is going to be the good old U.S. dollar. This fast currency move, may, you know, fast currency moves hurt markets in general. This move here, um, this, <laughs> this was fast and furious. Uh, and just think that you don't have the Jackson Hole meetings over. They just started, folks, okay? They started today. Market happens to be open today. But bottom line, over the weekend, what's coming out over the weekend, you can expect uh, that bottom line, we get a monster ABC down in the dollar. That dollar said, see ya, don't want to be ya. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about, whatever you focus on grows. Whatever you want in life, folks, visualize it. Step into it, take ownership of it, and fly with it. Everything you need is right inside you. Have a blast. Look forward to speaking right back here, Monday morning, 9 o'clock. You know what's cool? Go get him, folks. something that's good for you. Something specifically formulated to help with weight loss, better sleep, stress reduction, and the need to detox. Nico, our hunter and gatherer ancestors found all their nutritional requirements for health in their wild environment. But today, our food sources no longer contain the vitamins, minerals, and nutrients our bodies need to stay healthy and strong. That's why we need Primal Edge Daily Nutrition. It includes a special blend of ionic, soil-based vitamins, minerals, fatty, and amino acids in an easy-to-use liquid form. Primal Primal Edge is powered by highly concentrated folic and humic acids, nature's preferred delivery system. They have been called miracle molecules because, like sunlight, air, and water, life cannot exist without them. That's right, Paige. They ensure we receive all the nutrition we need to be healthy and thrive. We, we take, take it, it every, every morning. morning. Primal Edge, formulated and approved by Nico and Paige of Living a Primal Lifestyle. Buy it today for just $89. Click on the Primal Edge banner on the front page of TFNN.com.